Hey guys, it's the channel of Lego Morph, a Lego 2013, or sorry, 2016 set review, and this is the Clash of the Heroes set. It's set number 76044. It has 92 pieces, two minifigures with a exclusive variant of a character, and it retails for $13 in the United States. I don't have the instructions or the, um, the box for a set right now. Um, but without further ado, this is a set that coincides with the release of Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice, which a lot of people have been hearing are not liking, but the sets definitely do make up. So without further ado, let's take a look at our minifigures. And starting off, we have Superman here. Superman is basically the one that appear is the Santa that appears in the Batwing, except he does not have the dual molded, molded legs. There's his back printing and the front print. Love his face there. And he's got the laser eyes. So there is Superman. And he, of course he also has the, the Super Jumper. Which I have some studs on there to protect the minifigure. Because if you guys do not know they damage minifigure legs. And like, next up we have is the Armored Batman. Which is exclusive to this set. Love the armor piece on him. And he's got the nice cape and the grapple gun. His face also glows in the dark. Although... I really can't show you right now, but he also has that. Here's his armor. We'll move right off. And you can see a better look at his leg print, torso print. Here's his cape on the back print as well, which he didn't even need back printing, honestly, because it's covered by like the cape and all that. But it's a great little detail, honestly. I think Lego really adds... And again, you can see there's clips on the back for Batman's arsenal. So moving around, we have this little play set, well, little top of the building. You can see like a little gun turret or so, which can easily be removable. As you can see, you can make Superman knock it down. You also have a stud shooter here, which you can fire off and it can go right there. Or you can make it as an attachment to the back gun, which also in this crate. We also have some studs in there as well, some extra studs. And you can see there is a, a kryptonite crystal right here, which is pretty cool. And then you have this nice dark tan, like mesh area. You got a little control panel right here, which is a sticker. And you can put Batman right here, you can see. Nice little design. Once you push this, Batman can spring out and he can attack. And then you have the bat single signal with this nice uh, printed dish part, and it's also a flick missile, so you can you can fire it off right that. And a better look there at the print looks really good. So there is the Clash of the Heroes. Overall, I think for thirteen dollars, this is a set. I really do like, mainly because of the armor Batman and Superman. It's a great way to get both characters in a small set. Um, and, yeah, I think for $13, it's definitely good. I love the bat signal. Very good build there. And just overall, the play functions are actually pretty good for a $13 set, honestly. So I definitely do recommend it to anyone. It's definitely a great set in my book. Um, but I, mean, I want to hear your guys' thoughts about this set down below in the comments. Subscribe for more videos. And I will see you guys later. Bye.